Hi everyone, I am so excited. Today is the um, first showing of our brand new collaboration. It's a year long collaboration and we're celebrating 3D makes. In doing so, um, we are doing two 3D uh, projects a month, um, basically every, every other week. Um, so there's going to be so many amazing, fascinating projects and I can't wait to see everyone in the collaboration. Um, I'm very excited for each month and um, there's going to be a theme and the idea is to make a 3D object completely crafter's choice and to incorporate that theme onto their 3D project. This is hosted by Leslie Bromfield and um, I'm so excited. Um, there is one um, this month, June, because um, we're at the end of the month um, and the theme for this month is space. So I'm just holding up my board here because I'm going to do a sort of grand reveal of what I have made and I am I absolutely love it, I really do. And I've been so super excited to show you. I really love this theme and I really love the 3D project. So here it is, my space theme 3D make. It is the Space Arcade. <laughs> and what I have done here is I have created three arcade machines and then enclosed it in um, a special you know, video arcade. What I've done is uh, put like a, I've made like a long straw out of paper, just to sort of keep them there, but they're not in any way stuck down. They are removable. So I made this um, arcade machine following a BB Crafts tutorial because one of the stipulations for the collaboration is that you are not allowed to use a machine. So that's any cameo, silhouette, crickets. It's all got to be cut and scored and made by hand. You can use templates and um, you can, you know, use your cricket or whatever for you know, making embellishments, which I did here. I made the rocket, it's a flat embellishment. Um, but the rest is, you know, the 3D object, which this is my 3D object and the box itself is all been made um, with no machine. So I've made these three little boxes and they do open at the top and there's lots of room where you can put goodies or sweets. I was thinking, you know, with it being space, the lovely flying saucer sweets. I've decorated the sides with these uh, puffy stickers that I got from Hobbycraft and um, some star punches that I, you know, use this really nice um, glittery cardstock. And these um, images here, they're from a Maggie Holmes collection as well. I like because it's tickets and the little vintage sort of space raider type thing. Um, for the game screen I used um, some vinyl. Here I used some uh, dewdrops and I made a controller out of um, some fancy beads. So this is um, that one there and I'll just pull out the other two and they're all the same but just decorated a little bit differently. I just love them as, as a three piece. And here's the final one. That I love the little astronaut. And then as a little surprise element to mine, there's a reason why I'm filming quite late at night is it glows in the dark and I don't know if you can see it and I hope you can because I've been charging up these glow in the dark stickers <laughs> all day 
but these are glow in the dark stickers and I think it just screams the arcade machines because it's always a little bit <laughs> dark in there. Um, these are stickers here, these are 3D stickers that I got from Hobbycraft as well and then I just added the Space Arcade there. So um, I am super happy with this, I love it. Um, I cannot wait to see what the other collaborators have made. Um, all their details, their YouTube and their Instagram details are going to be in the description box. Please go check them out, please give them likes and subscriptions and follow us um, all year to see what other things that we make um so thank you so much for watching bye